Hello, my, my name is Ted Cote. I'm going to give you a quick tour of uh, our vintage 1974 Airstream Safari land yacht. It's 23 feet long. Um, it's a very snowy morning, morning here in Bozeman, Montana. And um, let's start the tour. We're going to start with the outside of the, the trailer. The previous owner had spent about a hundred hours polishing the shell and sealing the shell so that it has a really nice finish on the shell. It's got brand new tires, literally only been driven on about 500 miles to get from Canada to the United States. It spent uh, most of its life in British Columbia with, with a single owner who recently passed away and then these other people bought the trailer and then basically took a, pro a, a trailer that was really almost like a time capsule and just did a few upgrades to make it, you know, a really nice trailer. I'm gonna walk clearly around the t trailer just to kind of show you what kind of condition it's in. All the windows are in great shape. All have their screens all open perfectly. Here's the back. There's really no significant flaws in the finish as far as dents or creases or anything. I was really surprised how nice that was when I when I bought the trailer. We'll walk around to the front to the other side. Got two brand new, not brand new, but recertified uh, propane tanks that can be polished. They're, they're aluminum. Um, they're, they're filled. Um, it comes with, of course, a, a tow hitch and the stabilizers. I just towed this camper from British Columbia to Bozeman, Montana. And this trailer tows beautifully. The weight of the trailer is 3,850 pounds. So it's um, very light and has a really great frame. So it just seems like it's kind of hard to appreciate this finish because it looks a little like we're walking down a mirror. You're seeing everything in this, this little warehouse that I'm keeping it in temporarily. I'll walk all the way to the end here. Let's see it still has its branding here. Let's take a tour of the inside now. The trailer is currently winterized, so all the water's been blown out of it just to prevent any kind of freezing damage or anything. But it, I have put on all the lights and I have the heater running, so it's a nice warm 70 degrees inside the camper even though it's 16 degrees outside. The screen door is in great shape. As you walk in, you're gonna see that it's pretty much all original. In fact, everything's original, except maybe the floor has been replaced. Okay. So now we're inside the camper. I'm just gonna take a real slow tour walking through all the features uh, just to show you what shape it's in. This um, layout of this camper is really nice for a 23 foot. This particular couch um, has a, um, a fold out feature to turn into a double size bed. Um, it has tables that fold out to make a dining area. I won't do that during this video, but I've tested it and it works great. Um, I currently have the radio on just to show you that it works. It's kind of a cool setup. It's tucked away in this little compartment here. It's the original radio. I've got the FM stereo on. It's also got an 8-track tape, which still works. Let's just listen to a little Bee Gees from 1974. 
five. Yeah, it works. Everything works. I'll just turn that down for the rest of the tour here. Next, I'll show you the little storage compartments. Everything is clean in here. Got some extra A-Track tapes that are kind of vintage. Um, it's got an outdoor thermostat. Everything's working, has a clock. Um, everything works and it's clean. There's no cracks or anything. Um, the little kitchen area is here. The lights have been upgraded to an LED lights, some of them, so that, you know, gives you a little bit better light than it did originally. But the light fixtures themselves are all in original. They get kind of yellowed as they get older, but they all work. Just show you a turn off lights. One, two, three. And there's three lights that run down the length of the, the trailer. And they're all on, they're all working. This is the bedroom area, which has two twin beds. Each has um, a nightlight above it. Storage above each one. There's a closet here. Everything is in great working order. Not sure how to open this. First time I've opened it, but it's all in great shape. Um, there's storage underneath each bed as well with bins. Um, the stove is the original stove. It works perfectly. I've tested it. The heater is underneath the sink here. It has a double sink, which is kind of nice. A big window over the sink. Once again, all the storage areas are complete. Has some extra accessories that the owner gave me. I have all the original owner's manuals as well. This is really cool. This is the um, this is the control center for the old airstreams, and this one's just in great shape. It's got you know something that tells you whether your battery's working, your water tanks, auxiliary holding tanks, and main holding tanks. Anyway, it's a uh, really cool. Let's turn that panel light off for now. The refrigerator sits directly behind it kind of has like a little coffee station where you can put stuff and the refrigerator itself is working and uh, runs on both electricity and propane let's go check out the bathroom the bathroom's in amazing shape No cracking on any of the countertops. Shower is in perfect condition. Shower curtain. It's not all moldy or anything. Whoever restored this has just really did a great job with it. Has a closet in the bathroom as well, a big closet. There's an upgraded electrical converter system that the last owner upgraded to to make it more modern, but as far as looks go, it looks like all original. That's me taking the video. Um, once again, here's the the beds. They put kind of these quilted um, curtains on the bedroom windows. Each bed has a window above it. Each bed has tons of storage above and below like I mentioned it. There's a privacy curtain. Oh, real quick, there's a, let's see, here it is. A nice clean bathroom door. No flaws on it at all whatsoever. There's a nice privacy curtain that's between the bedroom and the living room area. I've never actually closed it, but I'm gonna do it now. But yeah, it's, it's clean. It's beautiful, actually. Anyway, that's the tour.